China module is that it's short, condensed, but we get the real um, aspect of real China. Our school is rich with a lot of professors with experience in both the U.S. and in China and they're able to deliver uh, the content of China in a form where I, for example, from the U.S. can really uh, digest it more easily. If you look at the future, no doubt the emerging market will be the key for economic growth. I hope our China module uh, will cover at least the two crucial issues. Number one is globalization of Chinese companies. And secondly, how the multinationals integrate China into global play. The course I teach uh, that's called Emerging Market, and which looks uh, more closely at the uh, flows of international capital around uh, uh, emerging markets. So it's important to understand how other political economies function, uh, and uh, China in, in particular, doesn't look like China is going to change because other countries are pushing China to change. I, I think several things. We, uh, uh, in, in this short class I, I'm teaching right now, actually, uh, I emphasize the, the role of the government in the Chinese economy, which I think is underappreciated uh, you know, in the literature. And also I emphasize the, the role of institutions, how China managed the stability of institutions in its reforms. I think these two elements are extremely important in terms of understanding China. I think for the students, they have to learn how to value stocks in China. And uh, if you are a manager of the firm, uh, where should you list your stocks? In comparison with you know, the leading schools in the uh, in the world, uh, Chang Hong has a very strong team of uh, faculties in finance. I want my students to understand that the alliances and the joint ventures are a long-term trend. Their importance uh, will continue to grow in the future. As I mentioned in class, alliances and the JVs have been around for 40 years and their importance uh, has grown over time. Initially, probably only contribute 10% of the revenue of Fortune 500 companies, and now this percentage probably is about 25. So I want my students to know that uh, the, the trend is that this number will continue to go up. And after spending some time here and speaking with some great professors and visiting some retailers uh, with the Chongkong students, it's very different. As U.S. companies look for further opportunities in China, it's number one on, the, on most companies' list. So having some experience really helps build a, a resume for me as I continue in my career. Since China is playing an increasingly important role uh, at the world stage, you've got to also understand how Chinese business is conducted. So as I just mentioned, this is the perfect place to, to do just that.